Are you listening to me? I have not sent these prophets. And this is what these preachers should be preaching. Yeah. But God said, I didn't send them. So if God didn't send them, somebody did. Somebody did. And the only one left is the devil. That's right. Huh? I have not sent these prophets yet what? Yet they reign. Oh, they out there too. Amen. Hands over their ears, spitting and hollering, hanging out with movie stars. Mm -hmm. huh? That's, That's right. why Joel Alstein, Kanye West can come in there with his old satanic choir, live like the devil and get, get all the wives all they want, make all the babies they want. And, while, and Joel Alstein just sit right there looking at them perform. <laughs> That's right. Didn't we enjoy Kanye? <laughs> That's right. Didn't we enjoy Kanye? That's right. Let me tell you religious fake or something. You <laughs> think these R&B singers and these entertainers and movie stars just because they sing some so-called Christian music or mention the name Jesus, you that much of a sucker think if they sing a song and mention Jesus, that make them a Christian? Mm. Jesus is a lifestyle. That's it. It ain't just a name in your mouth. Preach it. It's a lifestyle. That's it. Wonderful, brother. You can sing about his name. But if you don't live up to his teaching, your name ain't worth a dime. That's right. Wonderful. It's a lifestyle. Wonderful, man. You ready to call somebody a Christian because they use the name Jesus. Amen. Snoop Dogg now I'm talking about something. I'm, I'm one of Jesus' chosen ones. Liar. That's a lie. How in the world are you one of Jesus' chosen ones that got your own porn? That's right. That's right. Huh? That's right. Got your own porn, making your own porn tape. Still smoking your weed? Still smoking. Mm. I, I want to, so here, here make a, a song with Jesus. Yeah. Throw the name Jesus in there and still. That's right. But the, it, it, it's, it's, it's the Snoop bounce. It's the Snoop. It's no, no, no steps in particular. No. It's just the Snoop bounce. That's right. The bounce is telling you, I'm the devil, I'm the devil, I'm the devil. I'm the devil. My Lord, my Lord. So the so-called gospel singers, yeah. they get pure sinners on their albums. For what? For what? They are willing to sell out on God if it will sell their product. That's right. The Bible says you can't get sweet and bitter water from the same fountain. How are you going to cross paths with the devil Go to ahead. serve God's purpose? That's right. You're either on God's side or you're not. Or you're not. Entertainers come to many of our meetings all the time. NBA players and NFL players. What do I care? Amen. I don't give them no special seat Amen. at all. No, you don't. You ain't nothing but dust to me. That's right. That's all. That's it. I don't care how many millions you got. I'm not impressed. No. Why? Because you ain't got more than the Lord. Amen. Heaven and earth is his. Yeah. But we're going to take God and everything in it. That's right. My job as a minister of Jesus Christ is to prepare you to meet God. Meet God. Not to prepare you to get rich and That's wealthy right. and all that stuff. Go get a job. Go to school. Go That's to work. It. My job is to prepare you to meet the Lord. Finish up Jeremiah so I can knock off. I have not sent these prophets, yet they ran. Yes. I have not spoken to them, yet they prophesied. Uh -huh. But if they had stood in my counsel yes. and had caused my people to hear my words, then they should have turned them from their evil way. All right. And from Give the, me here, brother, real quick. And from the evil of their doing. Wait a minute. If they was what? But if they had stood in my counsel. You see, my job is to stand in God's counsel. These men are supposed to be standing in God's counsel. Right. And what? And it caused my people. And it's supposed to cause God's people to hear God's word. Then they should have turned them from their evil way. Wait a minute. Mm. These men ain't turning nobody from their evil way. No. They got dances and social parties right in churches. That's true. Right in churches, social parties. That's true. Dances. Social parties and dances right in the church. Amen. They're not turning nobody. No. And then the people are so used to it until they're like, wow. And then if a church don't have it, they say, man, I ain't down with that church. Yeah. I ain't down with that church. I like a church that can party. Yeah. I like a church that can jam. That's right. So you go to the main auditorium and talk about Jesus, then go down to the fellowship hall and slow drag, bumping and grinding with your girlfriend. My Lord. And then when I preached against it, you know what they say all over social media around the world? He's an extremist. <laughs> That's right. He's an extremist. Yes, no, I'm a will. Bible preacher. That's right. I believe that Bible. That's it. You will never get me from that Bible. No. I am hooked on the Bible. 
I shoot up with scripture. That's it. I, 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 I shoot up with scripture. That's right. Eh? That's right. That's all I'm interested in. That's all I don't care what you drive. I don't care what you own. All I know is when you walk this planet, you must live a life to please God because you're here for a while and soon you're going to be gone. Going to be gone. Give me, give me, go back to where we were, to the foundation of it. Amen. Real quick Back in 1 Corinthians 1 and verse 12. All right. Now this I say that every one of you saith, I am a Paul. I am a Paul. And I have Apollos. I am Apollos. And I have Cephas. I am of Cephas. And I have Christ. What? Is Christ divided? That's what I'm asking you, viewers. That's right. All these religions out here, the devil have put these religions out to bring division. Yeah. And God sent me along. I said, God did it. Not no board of directors or some cheap seminary school. I never took a Bible course since I've been black. And I've been black 59 years. And last time I checked, I ain't changing color. <laughs> That's right. I am sent to call you to Bible. That's it. Nothing else. That's it. That's right. Well, Pastor, somebody commented, said, Pastor Dennis, if I come to your church and they pass the offering pan around, uh, uh, if I don't have nothing to put in there, what would you say? I wouldn't say nothing. Nothing. You ain't got nothing to get in there. That's your business. That's right. But that you do got something to give, and it ain't a dollar. It's right. your life. life. That's the greatest offering you can give. That's right. It can't fit in a pan either. No. I'm not after your money. I'm after your soul. You're That's going to die one day, young man. Yeah. You see the streets of Boston and the streets of America? This young generation is being shot, murdered, killed all over the world. Yeah. Amen. And you just go to church on some Saturday, some Sunday to make you feel good. I'm not here to make you feel good. I'm here to make you think That's with right. scripture so you can get it right. That's right. The reason why the world is in the condition that they're in, the fear of God is not in them. Yeah. When I came up, we feared our elders. We respect our elders. Yeah. You get any household and the children become of age and that children do not fear and respect their father and mother, watch what happened to that house. Right. It's the same way what happened to church. The fear of God left church. The churches don't have no fear, no regard. They 